Hey everyone, it's Miss Amy from Camden Public Library and today we are going to do some dandelion science. So, the first thing that we're going to do is pick a whole bunch of dandelion heads and we are going to make, we're going to boil them down and uh, make some dandelion yellow dye. The second thing we're going to do is we are going to do an experiment with a dandelion fluff. We're going to see what happens in water. So let's pick a dandelion uh, puff. That's the seeds and we're going to take it inside and try it and we're going to dip it in some water and see what happens. Okay, so we have some dandelions boiling down and it's already, the water is already starting to turn a really pretty yellow. So it's really cool. This is science that you got to make sure that you are working with your mom and dad on doing don't try this at home by yourself. This is definitely a do together kind of thing. But let's see what happens with our dandelion when we put it into some water. Okay, so here is a glass of water and here is my dandelion and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the dandelion into the water. Whoa! Look at that. So I saw them do this on Dad Lab and I wanted to try this. This is so cool. So you can see that there are bubbles around the dandelion. You can see some of the seeds, but watch this. Whoa, so cool. It still is together. So I can put it down in the water and I can bring it up. Some of it's starting to come off because the dandelion is getting um, wet and water is getting inside it and it's an old dandelion. Very cool. It creates an air bubble, an air pocket around it. That is so cool. All right, so let's check on our, um, our dandelions that are boiling down. Okay, so now we're gonna strain this and see. This has only been going for about 10 minutes, maybe. Very cool, and I can already see how yellow it is. Really cool. It's kind of a yellowy green because there's a lot of green from the, um, the ends of the uh, dandelions, but it's very yellow. So let's try this. Okay, so here we go. We're going to start pouring and look how yellow that dandelion smush is. Look at that. Look at how, how yellow that is. Very cool. So yellow. I didn't even have to squeeze it out. So next, what we're going to do is we're going to see if we can dye a yellow piece of cotton fabric. So here we have a white piece of cotton fabric just a white square and this is the um, boiled dandelion water and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this into 
the water. Okay, so I'm going to put this into the water like this. And you can see it in there. Already it's turning yellow. But the longer I let it set, the darker it's going to be. So we're going to let that set while we try another dandelion fun thing. Have you ever really looked at a dandelion to see how beautiful a dandelion really is. See all those little, those little pastels, those little things at the top on the petals. That's where all of the pollen is and the bees come to collect. Very, very cool. A, a dandelion really is a beautiful, beautiful thing, even though it's a weed. So here is an amazing dandelion puff. So this one is absolutely perfect. Nothing is coming off this. You can see it kind of moving around. And I'm going to take off a dandelion um, seed, one of those seeds. And it, they are like little umbrellas and that's what helps them spread so when they start to let go or when you blow them all over the place they um, let's pick this one and do it so watch this okay you can see that the dandelion seed is attached to that little umbrella. It's a little tiny umbrella. Little tiny umbrella. You can see it wiggling around and that is what is going to make it blow and carry so that when it goes you can see it and it floats. Right now it's caught on a little piece of my skin. So you can see the seed right at the end and the white fluff, the little stem with the umbrella at the top is what helps it fly away. So let's, let's blow one because it's so fun to do that. All right, so here we go. <sighs> And you can see the, oops, you can see the seeds and where the seeds were in that head of the dandelion, all sticking out in a circular thing. It is so amazing. And you can see some of them starting to blow away. Let's see if I can get that in focus and you can see them. Oh, look, the wind is blowing some of them away already. It's incredible. So, okay, I'm going to take the piece out. And I want you to be able to see this now. I'm going to lay this on my counter. And it is yellow. It smells like dandelions, cooked dandelions. Because you can eat dandelion greens. And you can make dandelion tea. And dandelion jam. And all sorts of things. Very cool. Hard to tell how white that is, but I hope you try some dandelion science today. Happy, happy tinkering, Miss Amy.